around the table for that traditional Christmas dinner, but unfortunately, not everyone gets one. But Fox 6's Brett Baganski shows you one organization's work to help those families get that holiday ham. Their job is simple. Fill up 800 of these plastic bins with food. We joke it's like building a Rubik's Cube because everything has to fit in the bin, and people have been so generous that we have to be very careful to put all the stuff in and still be able to get the lid on so that it can go out the door later. That's one of the challenges for Sherry Tussler and about 40 volunteers at the Hunger Task Force. The other is filling them up all by noon Sunday. We ask everybody that we know to pitch in and do a little bit. We thought that it would be fun, so we started to do it. It's been a holiday tradition for Parker Hollis and his mother. It's fun. Good. We like to do it every year. It's also gratifying for him because he gets to help families in southeastern Wisconsin who've fallen on hard times. It's just nice to know that someone else can feel how we feel, that they know that they're going to have a good Christmas meal. It's a community effort where everyone works as a team, much like an assembly line. You have people carrying boxes while others do the drop. Little by little, can by can, juice by juice, before you know it, you've got 800 bins full of food. So essentially, this is what a completed holiday bin looks like. It has all the holiday goodies right on top. It includes chocolate peanut butter cups, candy canes, last but not least, Holiday ham. And this is a wonderful tradition for us to be able to help local families and not just give them the standard stuff like the canned tuna, the peanut butter, but to make sure that when they sit down on Christmas Day, they've got the same ham that you and I have. Brett Baganski, Fox 6 News. All the food used for these holiday bins amounts to about $90,000. The food was all donated by businesses throughout southeastern Wisconsin. Got a little bit of snow this weekend, but